just take your time, that's all you've got to do. Get a bow wave going and keep on pushing. No problem. Morning everybody, we're up nice and early today, I'm not going to lie to you, it's dark outside and uh, we've just uh, fed the calves, we've got the trailer on, we've just got the Dukes now to get uh, Tufty the Bull, he's going to get loaded up because he's off on his holidays, he's away and uh, we've got some little tuck lambs that uh, the Duke reckons are ready so we're going to take those in as well, so uh, we've already had one hurdle this morning We've had to wade through some deep water to get here because all the flooding from Storm Bobette and uh, the aftermath, we're off to Bakewell. We don't know what the Peak District's like. We've heard rumours that everywhere's flooded and roads are closed, etc, etc. So we're going to have to uh, make his way across and uh, see how far we get, basically. So we're just going to get the tuck lambs in, get tough to the bull loaded up and then we're uh, away. So if you've nothing better to do this morning, come with us, have a look round. These are my little calves. Get the light to come on. You press two. There we go. I told you it was dark. Terrible outside this morning. Sun's not even up yet. Got the trailer on. And uh, it's thick fog. Can't see the bottom of the field down there. So, uh, yeah. They're happy enough anyway on the nuts. So, uh, let's get up to the Dukes and uh, come on, Buzz. Away. Let's uh, go and get Tufty loaded. You getting in? Buzz a shotgun today. Come on, in you go. from Buzz. There they are, there's the boys. Got to get them in and sort the three big ones out in a minute. A Mexican standoff with the Duke. I don't know if you've noticed or not, but uh, Bob's not here this morning. And uh, before you ask, no, he's not on holiday. He's just uh, took his car into the garage this morning, so he's uh, he's not with us for the first part of the day. Just rejigging the fences. Try again. Oh, you've shed them. Yeah, I know. We've got them. We've got them. Hey. Oh, 
not shed the big ones out now. Yeah, there's five here, that's it. That was just a practice run, guys. Out you come. Go on. Come on, big lad. Come on, Tufty, off you go. Got him. But will he go in the will he go in the trailer? We've got him. He's in. Looking out the back window. Well, it's, it's uh, quarter to nine. We've made it to Bakewell. There was some right devastation and destruction on the way down. Roads like lifted, tarmac lifted, potholes everywhere. I saw a log, half a tree on a bridge, smashed through some railings at Baslow. Uh, so obviously the clear up's on. We've seen no end of road sweepers sweeping the road. But uh, all the grass is flat, you can see all the rivers, ditches and dikes that's burst. Holes in walls where the water's backed up and it's took the wall out. So, uh, but anyway, we're in the queue now waiting to unload the tubs and uh, that's it. Then we'll go and get a cup of tea. Buzzer's uh, fast asleep in the footwell. It was an early start for him. He's not used to it. Now he's half retired. Oh, we've got movement, we're moving. Right, we've got, got the top lambs weighed in uh, over the uh, over the check-in think counter, and it's uh, 38 kilos per lamb. So we'll see what prices we get today. There's, uh, there's the little lambs we brought in today. They've sold. Little tup lambs. Some calves going through over there. Just been in the calf ring. Some little kerries they've sold. I do like them. They look weird, don't they? But I do like them. 
and then there's some uh, are they Hampshire Downs or teddy bears teddy bears or Hampshire Downs if you know leave us a comment <laughs> we don't know not a clue Right, we're off for uh, a walk into town now. The Duke is going to visit his tailor and then we'll get some lunch. Just going over Lover's Bridge, as they call it. River's nice and high with all the rain we've had from Storm Bobbett. You can't see the fish today. padlocks on here still got the uh, flood defences up don't think that'll stop much though <laughs> here we go the Duke's on his uh, stall yeah like a base layer looking at milk tray sweatshirts for when he jumps through the window with a box of chocolates between his teeth. <laughs> Have you got any pericomos in or a nice Valdunigan cardigan? Valdunigans are coming in next week, there's a special offer. Is there? You get a free rocking chair with everyone. Oh, nice. That's it then. Can't go wrong. We're, we're looking for an autumn wardrobe for the Duke. An autumn wardrobe for the Duke? Yeah. Yeah, he needs some sort of Smoking jacket. It'd be better off at Ikea for a wardrobe, I think. one of yours? That's one at Posh Ones, that's his best going in, staying out jumper. You can wash it, you know. He's in boxes, he's in boxes. I've been here 40 years. Yeah. He's never had a good day yet. Never had a good day yet? Is never it busy today? Day. Yeah, right, pulling teeth here today. It's almost like Jesus. Good. Times are hard. Money short, you know the game. <laughs> I'm fancying a milk tray. They haven't grown in my size though. Milk tray polo neck. You can have them in like a, a bronzy colour as well. Anybody else on this MS? Here we are, sir. Another bargain. Another bargain, Another thank, you. Don't thank you. Thank wash you, whatever you do. Oh, well, why will the stitching come out? <laughs> Can't say. Can't, well, it's dodgy, isn't it? Got I've never much? seen I've never seen regatta tops. I'm supposed to say regatta. Yeah, well, there might be an odd G or a T missing, but. <laughs> It's a bit busy on Main Street. What? Well, I don't know. Look. Duke's after a job in chip shop. <laughs> that's it, we've had his chips. We're going to have a walk back now, and uh, that's it. I think collect us tools that we've bought and go home. Let's go and collect our tools from the tool man. We bought some. Uh... Have you thought about your bottle jack yet? I'll work out where I'm going home. Right. Duke's fancying a brand new 20 ton bottle jack. Gracias. Got a nice towel, nice trowel here. He's bilingual, this lad. Hey? Hey? What's he? He? he speaks all the languages. He even speaks Derbyshire. He even speaks Derbyshire dialect. Hey? I do towns there on the Sunday. Right, get some there. Who are we? Are you see horse? Or horse is horse. Horse is horse. You just get like caveman. Yeah. And you get some that's just like completely pigging. And you just don't be looking at something. And I'll just go, I can hear you. I'll just go, you're out there, right? Steve, I'm just giving the shout. And we just go. Like that's it. All right. Like, look at you. He's filming you, by the way. I'm filming you, know, you if it's our YouTube channel. You know that, don't you? You're going to start talking posh now, aren't you? So next right, week, you... <laughs> ne next week, you're... next week, oh, your stall will be overrun with customers next week. <laughs> I've told them I've been not getting away for a couple of days. <laughs> 
That's it then. We've uh, we've had his lunch. We've been to the tailors. We've had a look round. We've sold the bull. We've just seen him in the truck. Actually, the person who's bought him is off to uh, New Pastures. We think. And uh, that's it. We're coming back now. Hello. Here's Buzzy Boy. <laughs> Get down. What you got on your back? Yeah, you've been laid in mud. You've been laid in the mud. Been around them foxes again, haven't you? Having a wee? In the truck. Come on. Hey. Up, up. In the truck. Good boy. That's it. We've left the market now. Uh, we're on uh, on his way back. And uh, had an interesting day. Met a few uh, of the um, people who subscribed to the channel. And uh, I was a bit humbled, you know. Never knew that people actually watched the thing. So. But uh, apparently a couple of them said they enjoy it. And uh, as there's nothing on television, it's uh, something different to watch. So, uh, yeah. So good on you. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. And, uh, yeah, it's like everybody just kept coming up to me. So nice to meet you anyway. So, uh, yeah. But like I said, we're off to uh, Cars Billington now to get uh, some dog biscuits for uh, Buzz. And uh, the Duke, he wants a few bits and bobs. And then we're going back to uh, back to the ranch, get some jobs done. Feed the calves, etc. And uh, might start chopping some wood, seeing as uh, we changed the clocks at the weekend. Get some wood chopped, get the log splitter out, you never know. Well, there again, I might just sit and watch YouTube. I don't know. I haven't decided yet, but uh, at the moment we're still in traffic in Bakewell. And I do believe that this lot was underwater last week. Can see how the grass has flattened. But, uh, hmm. So uh, that's where I'm going to leave the video for today. Thank you very much. It's a nice short one. Just a day out at Bakewell. We did well. We did well with the tups. Uh, we did well with Tufty the bull. He's gone to a new home. And uh, yeah. So thanks for watching. We'll see you real soon. I'll try and make some more content as soon as anything happens. Uh, Bob's not with us today because he's uh, he's got problems with his glow plug. He's a bit slow starting in the morning, so uh, he's took his car into the garage. Get that sorted out. So hopefully he'll be back tomorrow. And uh, that's it. We'll see you soon. Don't forget share it with your friends if you really want to. It doesn't cost you a penny. Click the subscribe button and uh, yeah, see you on the next one. We're going to do something else now. See you in a bit. Bye.